Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel, and uh, we continue to uh, check out this week on the, um, of course, Windows Security app, and we'll look at the different options available. Uh, we, of course, talked about the scan in last week in one of the videos today, and the Windows Security app, we're going to talk about the account protection section and what it means. So um, the account protection information is to actually, um, if you use a Microsoft account, it will actually give you all the details of everything that is uh, linked to that account. The first thing, of course, it will tell you if you're signed in or not, and if your identity was verified. It verifies in different ways. You can be using Windows Hello, which means you can be using devices to sign in, uh, fingerprint reader, it could be a Windows Hello compatible camera and so on. There's, of course, account info that you can check, but it will actually send you into settings where you can actually jump from here and go even further. If you click Manage My Microsoft Account, you will actually be sent to the account information on the web. And there on the web, you will actually have access to all the information and everything that's related to your own account in uh, Windows. So you'll have information, as you see here, about everything, all the devices that you actually have, um, all the things that you have been uh, you purchased or been billed. You uh, will have, of course, the different subscriptions that might actually be part of all of this you will have um, more if you continue to the devices at the top you have where the billing is happening and all of that where if you have Microsoft rewards enabled you'll see how many points you have available um, and at the right side you will have how many devices are actually managed with your account and it's nice to sometimes go and clean it up a little bit for example I it says 10 but I probably don't have more than four or five active devices now. So of course, some of the devices that I have in there should probably be removed and managed. And of course, you can have all sorts of information at the top, you even have the privacy information and security information. And this gives you all the details of what's happening with your accounts and the privacy of your accounts. So that's one thing that you uh, might want to check. Of course, it would tell you with Windows Hello where you are how you are signing in with a pin, with whatever options of sign-in options. Finally, dynamic lock. Uh, this is you have your phone that has Bluetooth. What you can do with this the, uh, dynamic lock is that if you set it up and pair your phone, what happens is that dynamic lock will actually lock your device when it notices you moving away from it. And actually, I probably should have uh, dynamic lock information um, and and check it out and, and test it out a little bit and show you guys how it works. Uh, it is nice because dynamic lock, if you have more than one person where you are and always want to lock your computer, if you forget, well, if you set it up, when you move away, it will lock automatically because it'll detect you moved away with your phone. So uh, these are the different options available with the um, um, Windows security tab in the uh, options of account protection. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thanks for watching.